Tanaka, day two of Teacher Appreciation Week, and it is a big day. It is May 4th, so may the 4th be with you for all of our Star Wars fans. Now today, we are highlighting our amazing second and third grade teachers, and I was thinking about them. I was thinking about some of the powers of the force that they have. Check this out. Four cents. Second and third grade teachers, they can feel a disturbance in the force. Or when Blackboard didn't work, your internet was running slow, they taught us how to problem solve. Second and third grade teachers are also able to levitate. They taught us how to concentrate amongst distractions like Gary barking, Yoda, brothers and sisters in the background. Those are the powers that second and third grade teachers have. Yep, so many powers that our teachers have. Kindergarten and first grade teachers taking us to galaxies with Buzz Lightyear. Second and third grade teachers powering us uh, through the force. Now, I, I gotta tell you guys, I am a new Star Wars fan, so I'm just learning, but what I did find out that there are quite a few Star Wars fans at NACA. So check out this video and a couple other friends. I think Bailey for sure, her and her family are big Star Wars fans. So I wanted to share them, especially too, because Mr. Babuski I learned is a big Star Wars fan and he's one of our third grade teachers. So, oh, what a coincidence. So teachers, thank you for being so amazing for being so brave this year and learning, failing forward, and just being amazing. Well, not stormtroopers. Hmm. What are the other people you want to be? Not stormtroopers. Hmm. Jedis. Thank you for being the best Jedis that NA has ever seen. Bye, Naka. Hi, I'm Bailey Schmidt from Florida. And my family loves Star Wars. We actually named our dog Chewbacca after Chewbacca from Star Wars, but we call her Chew. So these are some Star Wars things I have. I have lots more, but these are some of my favorites. So this is a Porg, and he will actually talk. Then I have a Chewy. I have a Chewbacca bobblehead. And I have a Han Solo bobblehead. And then I have an R2-D2. It's like a remote control, but I don't really use that as it, and I have lots more. May the force be with you.